Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Wang, and congratulations to the Center for China and Globalization for this, for this invitation, which comes at a very timely moment, and also for the publication of, of this book. You know, to talk today about China and the world in a changing context inevitably means to talk about the attitude of, of China towards the, may, the most serious crisis uh, in peace, for peace and security in the European continent since 1945. This is a situation which places uh, China in a very significant position and could give China a very important role. For a number of reasons. First of all, of course, as a P5, it has a special responsibility for maintaining peace and security. Secondly, it has a very special relationship with Russia, which it can put to good use, because China, because Russia is also becoming probably uh, by with the course of time and, and the development of events, more and more dependent on on of this relationship with with China. But also because China has been a rising power which has benefited immensely from stability. Stability has been fundamental for the rise of China, and uh, you have always declared to be a country in favor of stability. You know, if the conflict continues, the global economic consequences will be very serious for all, but especially for China because of its dependence on world markets, because of its sensitivity to inflation, to loss of jobs in such an important political year as 2022. Also, if the perception abroad, especially in Western countries, is that China is perhaps not doing everything it could do to help facilitate a ceasefire, this could affect also the perception of China in other countries. Um, China, as the rest of the international community, has a lot to lose from this crisis, but also has a lot to win. It has a lot to win if it contributes to making the stability of the international economic system again come back uh, with positive results for your economy and for the economy of the rest of the world. But also, uh, if you are perceived as playing an important role in uh, achieving a diplomatic breakthrough, uh, an early ceasefire, because as Basil said, we cannot lose to one day. Every day, terrible things are happening are happening and we cannot just uh, go to sleep. So you have um, a problem and an opportunity. And this opportunity, if you play it well, can not only be good for your economy, it can be extremely good for your international stature and certainly for your relations with European Union and Western countries, and not only European Union, all Western countries. I'm sure you know that much better than me. Thank you.